everybody. This is Gunman66 here. Uh, I've been working on some of my guns today, doing things. Um, took my 7mm. Yeah, I have to show you this. I, when I first bought it, I thought, oh yeah, those sights that are on it, those are no good. You know, I need to make it look like a real gun. I'm going to take those sights off of it. But now, three years later, I realized, you know what? Guns don't even come with sights anymore. Got plenty of clean barrel rifles now. So I thought, you know, that was really cool. And then 700 BDL have those sights on it. So I just put them back on, and we're gonna go over and see if I can still shoot, still hit anything with it. And I'll show you those sights and check it out. It'll be really cool. Okay, so you can see. I put that front sight back on and go back here la, la, la. there's the rear sight and at first you know I thought well we don't need these sights anyway I got the scope and it'll look more like an African game rifle but the more I thought about it the more I thought you know those sights were actually kind of cool and they really don't interfere with that scope anyway Look at this front sight. Let me sneak around the front of this gun here. It's got that hood on it. That thing is cool. So what we're going to do to make sure that it's still sighted in, I've got these uh, PPU. They're 140 grain. And we're going to be shooting a target way down there by the fence post. You can see that. And I'm going to put this camera down there so you guys can see the target when I shoot it. Okay, so here we are, way down here at the other end of the field. Um, let me show you these targets we're going to be shooting at. So we put up this little can right here. And I'm going to see if I can hit that circle in the center of that can we're about 90 yards away from the target and then hopefully i can hit that and if i hit that then i've set up this can of a rock star here and we're going to blow that rock star all to hell and it should be a really cool video now i'm going to have to set the camera up right there on that tripod and i'm going to have to run all the way back down to the other end of the field. I'm not going to be able to run very fast because my knee is all stoved up. It hurts like heck. I think it's swollen. I don't know what's going on. It sucks to get old. But let me set this camera up and then I'll run down there and see if we can hit this target. Okay, now barring that the wind doesn't blow down my camera, hopefully... You guys will be able to see if I hit those targets. And I can't tell if the rock star's in the picture or not. Hopefully it is. Okay, I'll be right back. We're going to shoot.
All right, you guys. Well, I say I'm pretty lucky that I didn't shoot my camera. That first shot, I didn't mean to shoot it, but I accidentally touched that trigger, and man, it went off. Let's go see if we hit those cans. Well, looks like the uh, Rockstar got exploded pretty good, but I don't think we hit this one. We moved it, and I don't know exactly. Oh, I think my bullet hit right there. I think my can, where was it sitting? I think it was sitting right there, but it looks to me like that's where the bullet went. Well, you know what, guys? I'm gonna give that one more try. It looks like we got the rock star really good. And I'm gonna go ahead and do this off camera because running back and forth down there with a bum knee really sucks. But hey, you guys have a great day. I love shooting guns. Anytime I can get out and shoot guns, it's always a good day. So go out and have fun. We'll see you next time.